Sample size calculations. Analytical cross-sectional studies. Purpose. To determine smallest optimal number of participants to be included in an analytical cross-sectional study. Necessary to detect the clinically relevant effect or difference. Optimal sample size. 1. To reduce cost. 2. To improve precision. 3. To mirror reality and rule out chance. 4. To limit unnecessary exposure. And 5. For ethical concerns and statistical justification. Study designs. Design of analytical cross-sectional study. First, define your population. Secondly, determine presence or absence of exposure and disease in each person simultaneously. Thirdly, measure association by prevalence ratio or odds ratio. Sample size prerequisites. Assign 1. Proportion of disease in cases, B0. 2. Proportion of disease in controls, P1. Both are assigned based on literature review. 3. Ratio between study arms, R, which is the ratio between cases and controls. 4. Assign p-value and zeta alpha over 2, which is usually 1.96. And finally, 5. Assign power of study and zeta beta, which is commonly 0.84. Equation 1. Kelsey equation with 5 variables. R. Ratio of cases to controls. P0, prevalence or proportion of disease in cases. P1, prevalence or proportion of disease in controls. Zeta beta, which is power of the study, 1 minus beta, defined as ability to detect difference. Beta, which is type 2 error, defined as failure to detect existing difference. Beta is commonly 0.2. Zeta alpha over 2, which is level of significance corresponding to 95% confidence interval which is commonly 1.96. Alpha is type 1 error, which is erroneously detecting difference. P0 minus P1 is effect size. Equation 2, slice equation, with the same five variables as in Kelsey equation, but different rearrangement. Equation 3, flies continuity correction equation, with the same five variables as in Kelsey and flies equations. As seen in the equation, it is a prerequisite to calculate sample size by equation 2, n flies, if flies correction sample size is to be calculated. A Kinsey equation variant. Sample size calcs. Tip. The higher the difference between the disease prevalence in cases and controls, the smaller the sample size will be. Example calculated by all equations and epinfo software. First step is to assign the five variables. Case control ratio R equals 2. Baseline prevalence is 45%, indicating a P0 of 0.45, while the desired prevalence is 30%, indicating a P1 of 0.3. The power of the study is fixed to 80%, zeta beta 0.84. Assume level of significance at 1.96, zeta alpha over 2, equals 1.96 sample size calcs Kelsey equation Fleiss equation and Fleiss corrected equation the later has a larger sample size than the others control sample size is twice as large as case because R equals 2 Sample size calcs. Kelsey equation variant. Starts with calculating the p-bar. Average proportion exposed. Sample size calcs. Using epin for software.
statistical packages used for sample size counts. References <laughs>